blockchain is all about. <laughs> because most of us don't. <clears throat> At least I don't fully understand, but I know that it's very valuable. The UN has created, not the UN, but some people within the UN have created what we call a commission for blockchain for the good. That means how can blockchain be used for SDGs and poverty reduction and so on. So I would like now to give the floor to our next uh, speaker, Mr. Robert Cipriano, who is the CEO of All Humanity. You have the floor. Thank you very much. I'd like to thank Pialo and Gloria for inviting me back this year. It's an opportunity to uh, to share some of the goodness that's going on and to share your goodness that's going on. Uh, as the CEO of All Humanity Group, uh, I absolutely acknowledge Info Poverty World Conference for the significant global compact that they're, they are doing. The primary positive roles that they're, they're doing towards the, the sustainable development goals. This year we'd like to talk about a new opportunity to open the bridge between the UN, Info Poverty, and faith-based projects and initiatives. For far too long, there has existed a canyon-wide gap between all the wonderful projects taking place within the UN, UN affiliates and, and allies, and humanitarian groups, and the faith-based world and sectors. And it's sad because this faith-based is a very highly motivated group that wishes to do good and to, to bring together the, the, their resources and their attitudes. This gap has to close in order to really maximize the impact set forth in the UN SDGs. We have two very highly motivated groups of people that want to work together. And the SDGs have set us up with a very clear roadmap, hunger, poverty, gender equality, education, environment, healthcare, and SDGs. Most importantly to today's discussion is SDG 17, sustainable partnerships. That is why we're all here. We're here to find out what we're doing and how to work together. And now with the Info Poverty, we're focused on telemedicine and food securities, and now some of the new technologies. All Humanity is all about bringing that all together. We're all part of All Humanity. So what we do is sort of manage that process. We, man we manage the bringing together of people and ideas and visions and bring the technologies in and then be able to communicate that to the world in a mass sort of way. So today, we brought something very special. Today, I'd like to introduce something called Uplift TV. What if I told you that we, what if I told you we want to hear, see, and experience your stories? We want to hear about your great works all over the world. What if I told you that you have the opportunity now to share those stories and the journeys and your successes with over 20 million households in the United States? What if I told you that you can craft your story, our story, together for an audience that's ready to already open their heart and many times their resources? What if I told you this is here and now and together we can make this happen? We have a very short uh, video I'd like to show you. Hello, I'm Bob Higley, CEO of Uplift TV, a faith and family television network reaching 24 million households in the U.S. and expanding to 90 million later this year. I'm very excited about the opportunity to address the members of Info Poverty Organization as a guest of Robert Cipriano and the All Humanity Group. Rob and I are developing a plan that will be a collaboration between Uplift TV and All Humanity to help info poverty nonprofit organizations in UN approved countries to receive television coverage on Uplift TV in the United States, the most generous country in the world. This TV coverage will help all of the wonderful nonprofits that are doing such great and important work to be seen, heard, and shared with potentially millions of viewers and help obtain the needed financial support to help their cause. And now, let me take this opportunity to show you some highlights of Uplift TV.
Thank you for watching. Imagine this All Humanity Network joining hands together with Uplift TV to provide nonprofit organizations access for the purpose of creating content, documentaries, nonprofit interview programs, nonprofit featured broadcasts, and any and all other acceptable humanitarian programming for creation and to show it to the world. It's, it's a, it must be. The main three features. The airing of approved, created productions on Uplift TV, which is currently available, the 24 million household theme, via DirecTV, Frontier Communications, Hotwire Communications, Broadwire, uh, Buckeye, Consolidated Communications. They are expanding into multiple Uplift TV branded TV experiences internationally with such things as cell, cell phones, iPads. Um, tablets in an international basis with major services such as Apple TV, Google Play, Amazon Fire, and Roku, bringing Uplift TV truly global. So, because of this tremendous opportunity here at Info Poverty World Conference around the world, together we can get your story out. I've sat here all day today listening to one story after another, from water filters to, to, to the ICTs to the SCVs to every possible situation. This story needs to be told. It needs to be out there and it needs the ears and the eyes and the hearts. So what we're offering is that opportunity. The time is now. Let's tell your story. Thank you. Our spirits. <laughs> That's what we want to go with an uplifted spirit. Thank you very much. So I now have.